Hi, I'm Lisa with JDS Industries, and today I'm going to show you how to sublimate the Unisub fiberglass reinforced plastic products. These products come in a wide variety of pre-cut shapes and sizes, and it also comes in sheet stock as well. Some of the, the products also come in a, either a matte or glossy finish, and some products also come in one-sided or two-sided. So you have a wide range of options when you're sublimating this product. The nice thing with the Unisub products is these products are nearly foolproof to sublimate. There's not a lot of playing around that you have to do with this to, to get a really good image to come out. So the products you're going to need to sublimate is you're going to need your transfer. This is printed on a Rico printer with sawgrass inks. You'll need your substrate and you'll need some heat tape. So first we're going to tape our substrate down onto our transfer and I made uh, my image just slightly bigger than the actual luggage tag that I'm doing just so I can see where to center it. And then just take a couple of pieces of heat tape and just to hold the tag in place while you're moving it around and flipping it over to put it in the heat press. Now this product we're going to sublimate at 400 degrees for about a minute 20 to a minute 30 at medium pressure. Um, you don't have to get quite so exact with the pressure. This is very um, easy to do product, so you shouldn't have it too much trouble. Now when we're putting this in the heat press, we're going to use our Teflon sheet on the bottom like we usually do. And then we have our, our paper towels that we use a lot on a lot of the rigid products. That just helps uh, equalize the pressure and it also will pick up any residual ink. Uh, the thing to remember when you're doing a two-sided product is you want a very clean surface every time you sublimate because it can pick up uh, previous images that are on your paper towel or Teflon that will, that will transfer onto, the, onto your product. So you want, really want a clean surface when you're sublimating a two-sided product. So on top of our, our paper towel we have our luggage tag and with our transfer on top. And that's because this product is not uh, heat conductive and so you, it would take longer for the heat to get through the luggage tag to the transfer if we put it in the press that way. So you want to flip it over so your transfer is closer to the heat. And then you top it off with another Teflon sheet. And again we're going to do 400 degrees for about a minute 20 medium pressure. Larger size products you're going to have to go probably a little longer, 10 to 15 seconds longer depending on the size of the product. Okay, release your press slowly to avoid any vacuum effect that could happen. Swing it away, remove your Teflon, and then pick up your product by the paper edge. And since we have it taped on two sides, you can just tear the, the paper down the middle. And you can see here we've got a completed product, still very hot. If you do need to do the second side, Make sure you cool it completely before you go to do the, the second side. You see these products do come out very nice and glossy. Not a lot of tips, not a lot of trick to doing these. They're very easy to do. That's the one thing we really like about the, the Unisub products. They're very nice coating on them. If you have any questions about these products or any other JDS product, you can contact our customer service at 800-843-8853 or visit us, visit us on the web at jdsindustries.com. Thank you.